Hey, what's going on, guys? This is uh, Mad Hatter representing for DA Dangerously Active League. Uh, just pretty much want to give uh, my guide, my version of um, dual tanking uh, with the two tanks for um, PC Elite. Um, just again, I've done this before. I'm never going to say I'm like the best tank, or whatever. Just want to give like the basics of this mechanic because it's pretty much. Uh, annoying for most and I do understand a lot of people don't know the mechanics of it um, a lot of people here pretty much um, either slip in or lead members try to bring them in um, which is fine you know if you don't know but um, it's a little bit frustrating for the other guys that run elite consistently and was uh, just all about elite so it's pretty annoying when you have somebody come in and they don't know and they get a little bit of shame or embarrassed not to say I don't know and you kind of weed them out instantly because of the mechanics because they either ran the event so much or the irregular it's pretty much uh, just run through it and so if you're tanking if you choose to tank if you grind the skill points for your tank or any specific roles make sure you main you know your role you mastered it uh, you know you you test your your abilities as much as possible so you feel like if you're prepped and ready for um the elites you know definitely come on down because we're missing so much tanks so much um support roles it definitely just the lack of communication uh when there is none so all right i'm gonna give my little my little two cents of it so pretty much for me when i'm tanking this the boss side because we're gonna do this like in two parters we're gonna do it in tanking the boss and then we're gonna do it in tanking the ads Now i know a lot of people have their own variations of how they flip the board and how they do this how to do that and that's fine i'm just giving which is pretty much i've seen it's a common it's a consistent way when uh, we have a solo tank um that solo tanks it a lot and the group is just a little bit not knowing the mechanics too overwhelming so they tend to change it up a bit but pretty much the go-to is is always two tanking it for uh, most so here we are now we're gonna go with the tools that we need for the boss so pretty much you got your tank gear so that's number one because you will get inspected all right you got your artifacts keep that handy now we're gonna go to our loadout now for me again everybody changed everybody's different so let me repeat that because we got slow special people that like to comment and say hey why don't you do this why don't you do that everybody's different you know it works for me it may not work for you it might be easier to give uh tell me something that uh, again nobody's perfect here so we don't know so this is the helpful guide for everybody else so again for me for the single taunt, I don't use one of my lasso because the animation of it takes too long. And for most tanks, especially for Earth, the um, the single taunt is a super taunt. It acts very quickly, like so. You just hit it once, you're good to go. All right. Back to our loadouts. So, from left to right for me, you got um, Pebble Stone. It's a super taunt. Uh, heart light shield uh, gemstone shield you can actually activate this while you're getting juggled or beat <laughs> down so that's very helpful uh, you have perfect poise um, I have totem and I have um, brick those these three right here is pretty much optional and I say this because I've seen other um, earth tanks use something different when they um, single taunt the boss some people don't like to use totem uh, with golem some people substitute um, totem out and they like for example I've taken out um, totem and use um, deflection I've taken out perfect poise only because I didn't have time to build up supercharge and swapped in um, deflection and left totem and brick um, open or I might swap out totem just for unstoppable just to keep building up my um, perfect poise for the supercharge and um, that's it I seen one use um, jackhammer just for the uh, the, uh, the uh, defense the 55% defense increase which is again fine and very helpful 
I seen someone swap out totem for a uh, fortified golem to help give your um your totem power and an extra shielding, which is very cool because it, it it works. It definitely works. So again, you have options with this and that's pretty much it for that one. Also, let me throw out an um, option. Uh, you can also change one of your mods for your gear to uh, every time the boss pretty much lunges at you, it'll knock it back. So that helps out a lot. All right. So pretty much. So let's just say, for example, you and a tank is cross each other. Oh, I forgot one more thing. This is to me, this is a staple. Your man back trinket. And I say this, for example, if you're rolling from one end to the other, let me get rid of um, brick. If you're avoiding your boss, you get so much distance from your boss. Okay. So that's just one roll. Now, if I go through the straight animation of it, that's pretty much the whole board from there. Now, let's just say, for example, I don't have it on and I'm taunting it and I need to get a get out a quick roll. That's your distance. That's a big, big difference versus this and man bat. But also make sure you have on your um, your mod your tumbling master mod that helps out a lot okay so now we got a lot of tools and arsenals ready for um, the boss now the boss is pretty much set up in the middle with the one at you and the other tank pretty much sing each other or if you're on the mic and you go you start it up hit it with a taunt pop your shield or your shield and taunt roll back in your designated positions I like to try to stay as much in the brown as possible if you happen to roll out that's fine just situate yourself and get back in I taunt kite myself over this side taunt again roll over taunt again just be very mindful of um, all the sidekicks the booze and even your own that comes back and forth because uh, sometimes you can just walk around it, no pressure, walk around it, taunt, roll back. Or if you would time it, the boss is pretty much a little bit, sometimes might be up in the air, you could roll under it. Or you can jump over him, roll over him. <laughs> if you're acrobatic, I even tank them while I just roll up here and hit them. Just pretty much just something to get around. It's not no big deal, but just step outside the, uh, the imagination a little bit. Um the next one so let's just say for example you have your um your portals phase so your portal phase coming up when your portal phase come up you have four portals two well actually three but two of the little ones is the, the main one you want to um jump into so you have one here one here one here and one here those are the four main ones that you want to um, jump into but only two spawns so you might have two of the front two in the back one in the front one in the back and so have you so now i got to step outside the box a little bit so now i got to taunt them you hear her um her war cry she has a screen a red um, message on the board that's your first telltale sign it comes out if you're if everybody's on the mic and communication is great you call it out because some people is not very visible doesn't see everything coming i don't know why it happens so you call it out you know yell out block or whatever you need to do you take care of yourself you run to the portal that might be here is the closest taunt get your shield up you block if you feel like your taunt is slipping let's say the next six to twelve seconds taunt again depending on the group or the situation, roll out, get back to your um, your same position and just kite up and down left or right. Same thing if the portal was over here, you taunt, usually the portal will be over here. Taunt, holo aggro, bam, and roll out. Now you're saying, hey, my hatter, what if the uh, the two portals way back here and it's gonna take me a long time to get there I promise you you have enough time with three options what two of the options I'm gonna give you that you'll be there on time and here's one of them you have again you have your man bat trinket so that gets you quicker but your first telltale sign is when 
the boss has the red sign come up or if you have your subtitles up the message and the red sign will come up first and then she speaks once that happens you stop everybody stop what they're doing start working your way down there now you have a split decision not too split but a good one but be mindful while you run it all the way down here you're um you're also locked on the boss and you can keep an eye on the skull that comes up so it won't be charging after you so you have a split decision so either i go left with the other tank here and the healers or do i go right where there's no tank and maybe a healer or not so uh, not a healer so or there's a big portal that's here in the middle that causes a one shot or there's a bigger portal here on the opposite end that causes one shot so again you have two decisions either a i'm gonna pick a portal block and taunt get out i'm good to go or i'm gonna come in here with the rest of the group taunt block shields up and then get out of the way or if the bigger portal is here and both the groups on this side you got the taunt this was come a little clutch a little clutch moment here if it's just you or is it the second guy if you get there first go to the corner adjust your camera angle you have it on the boss you have your shield up so it's aggro you look to your i'm gonna say you're right you'll see the portal on whatever side of need if it's the opposite side of the stairs you're good so you see the portal you see a huge car come around it once it go full way and a one shot red wave come you can pretty much roll out of it you're safe now the portal is on the opposite side like here you go opposite to the stairs block look for it if you can't see the portal because of the camera angle you will see a red wave you are good to go but always make sure you time everything that you do okay now a little extra for the uh the portals because there's two little telltales to make sure you got it because again it's a lot of animation all the little the cool little auras around you so you're like hey i can't see everything but if you can look at it very closely if you see the little white wavy lines around my tune right now and my uh, my totem it will look similar to that but it'd be red little waves so if you're inside the portal before the small portals go full circle this will give you an out before the other group when you know you have all little red squiggly lines on your tune and you're inside the portal you're good to go to roll out okay roll out get back adjusted taunt and start kiting the boss upside back and forth up against the wall that's pretty much it so again if you're up here and you're in that quick moment where you need to get out and one of the um, players uh, break out and try to get the group killed by mistake because they're not watching what they're doing and you need to stay on your game look for the little red squiggly lines if you see all the squiggly lines on you just roll out get the aggro roll out and start kiting the boss back up up here again and you're good to go that's pretty much how it goes with um with tanking the boss okay so again just to give <clears throat> excuse me just to give a brief rough down uh, everything again start with your arsenal what do i need for um the single taunt the boss because i'm I'm tanking the boss, not the ass. So you have your loadout from left to right. Again, the last three have options, but this is the one I stick with. So you have Pebble Stone as a super taunt. You have your Heart Light Shield for protection. You have your Gemstone Shield for protection. You have Perfect Poise uh, for again for protection. And it's a get out of to me. It's like a quick move animation, and I'm gonna activate it now. So let's just say if you get stuck, pop it. You run extra. You're immune, you got the little defense, see how quick I'm running. And there you go. Next you got totem. Help um heal break and serve protection. And then you have totem itself that helps you from on um, protection. You can swap those out if you want to as an option. You can swap out totem for uh, Amazon deflection. Let's say we do that. 
again the boss does lunge and juggle and because of the mechanics of the fighting style of the boss you can pop this sucker once and that's fine it'll give you a few extra seconds to recoup and regroup yourself to get yourself back situated just in case if you popped by mistake both your shieldings and your protection and you get into that oh no situation pop um and it wears out pop reflect um amazon deflection just to get yourself situated again the um the cooldown can get off of the um, gemstone shield and your um your heart light shield but you cannot keep it there you cannot keep this position long you cannot because what the boss would do it will um break you out of it and that would be an issue okay so again you have options so next for your options are in your arsenal again again tank gear the proper mods for it this is the extra shielding right here personal damping field your artifacts and that's pretty much where it goes from there okay so it's gonna be a video after this to show you how I tank this uh, for the first boss and there you go so I appreciate it again if guys if you come across people is not to throw shade at or anything else because again everybody doesn't know the proper mechanics of the tank uh, everybody just don't know and um, you know just share comment if you even have some tips for me to say hey I got a better way here's the video or how you try this great appreciate it the more information the better because DC Universe is a is a is a shrinking community and we see the same players consistently all the time so we need to help out as much as we can all right so I appreciate it all righty got my single Chad, I'm ready on you <coughs> all right we're good to go Now when the ads come up, can we please get all DPSs accountable on the ads, please? And thank you. Since we're checking everybody. Ads are up. Ads are up. That's a big ass supply drop. God damn. <laughs> All right, as is up. Supercharge. That's on me. Block, 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 block. Block again. Block, block, block. Block, 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 block. I got him. I got him. I got him. Heal is too close. Give me a sec. I got him. Portal's up. Block, 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 block. Yeah. <sighs> Yo. All right, I got, I got him. Yeah, I saw. Block, block, block. All right, I got him. I got him. I got him. As out. I got the boss. Block, 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 block. Portal's up. 
portals up. Block, 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 block. All right, suppressor, suppressor, wherever you are. Block, 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 block. All right, got him. Come here. Hand clap, hand clap, hand clap. Block, block, block. Block, 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 block. Portals. Oh shit, where are they? Fuck, fuck, fuck. Stairs, fuck, get fuck, to the stairs. Fuck. Just go on the stairs. Yeah, yeah, I'm here, I'm here. Uh, the tank will get it. For the the tank will get it. All right, cool. I'll grab it when I get back. Ads. All right, got it. Got Lock. It. Appreciate it, troll. I meant healer. Yeah, man. I'm fellow troll too now. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah, I got every row. Block, so block, 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 block. Block, 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 hand clap, hand clap. And fucking portals. Oh my god, you killing me fucking uh complex. Block, 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 block. On what? me. Get ready. Block. On one woman. Block, 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 block. Good shield. Block, hand clap, and portals. Oh, portals. <sighs> Block. So lucky, Arian. I saw that. But hand clap. Healers out. Block. You stuck between Batman and you fire. Sorry, baby. Block. Portals. This is last ass phase. Oh, shit. Where's the portal? Where's the portal? Got it. Move.
Block. What the fuck, yo? Get the suppressor. I got the suppressor. I'm on the suppressor. Yo, can we please kill this bitch? Uh, Cause I missed and hit my fucking armory with my keyboard. <sighs> oh my god. Block, hand clap, hand clap. Block, charging again. Plus portals. Suppressor. I got him, I got him, I got him. Move. Heels. Thank you. Oh, you pulled it from me. I can't believe I did that on accident, man. Yeah, you need to tighten up. Yeah. <laughs> 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 nah, look, listen. Block, though, I'm block, block. I'm sitting here, I'm sitting here like, uh... Fucking, why did my armory just go off and I realized my leg hit my keyboard? <laughs> 